Good evening. An East Mountains community invaded by loose bulls. One even caught on camera rummaging through a man's yard. News 13's Ryan Martin spoke to that neighbor who's trying to track down where the trespassers are coming from. Ryan. Madeline, every day for the last week, this homeowner wakes up to destruction on his property. Been here 40 years and never seen anything like that. It's a bizarre sight turned common for Dick Stewart in the Sandia Knowles area. Bulls in his backyard. And it's easy to tell where they've been. A lot of these, of course, are hoof, uh, hoof prints uh, from the days prior, too, mixed in. That's a new one there. Pretty deep one, too. Stewart's caught several of the wild nights on camera, including this one, when a bull knocked over his bridge while trying to drink from a pond, leaving a trail of damage. As it progressed, it began to just explore my whole property. I've been every corner of the property now. Stewart believes they come through this trail and make his plants into a late night snack. And uh, I put, we put a lot of work into it. It's a very much a pride and joy for us. We went to where he believes they're coming from, possibly belonging to a farmer beyond this tree line. Neighbor Christopher Jones tells us he knows that farmer and says it's not his fault they're getting out. With most of what's going on here, the only reason the cattle are getting out is just people are going through their hike that are hiking up there and riding bikes and I mean they're snipping the fences. Outdoor enthusiast likely unknowingly letting livestock loose. So it's just it's making a difficulty for the farmer over here and cattle finding their ways to get out, different breaks in the fence line. We called the farmer today but did not hear back. Stewart is reaching out to him too, try to keep this from happening again. Madeline? Okay, thank you, Ryan. One neighbor says he's seen the farmer trying to wrangle the loose bulls on a couple of occasions. Developing news tonight.